If I speak with tongues of men and of angels, but have not love, I am become sounding brass or a clanging cymbal. And if I have the gift of the prophecy, know all mysteries and all knowledge, and if I have all faith so as to remove mountains, but have not love, I am nothing. And if I bestow all my goods to feed the poor, and if I give my body to be burned, but have not love and profit me, nothing. Love suffering long and is kind. Love envieth not. Love vaunteth not itself, is not puffed up, does not behave itself unseemingly, seeking not its own, is not provoked, taketh not account of evil, rejoice in unrighteousness, but rejoice with the truth, bear in all things, believeth all things, hopeth all things, endureth all things, lever, love never faileth, but whereof there be prophecies, they shall be done. Anyway, whether there be tongues, they shall cease. Whether there be knowledge, it shall be done away. For we know in part, and we prophesize in part, but when that which is perfect is come, that which is in part shall be done away. When I was a child, spake as a child, I felt as a child, thought as a child, now that I've become a man, I put away childish things. For now we see in the mirror darkly, but then the face to face. Now I know in part, but then shall I know fully, even as I also, I was fully known. But now abideth faith, hope, love, and these three, and the greatest of these is love. This was the first book of Corinthians, chapter 13.